Hidden in the jungles of downtown LA lies a small independent school called La Escuela Argentina de Los Angeles. Every Saturday, students from K through 12 meet not too far from the University of Southern California, where they are not only taught how to read and write in Spanish, but they also learn the history and culture bounded to their Latin roots. I was born in Argentina. My wife is from Canada. And it's been really difficult for me to transfer our Argentinian culture to my son. At all. And uh, he was able to absorb our culture, learn not only to speak Spanish, which a lot of Latins do know in, in, in California in particular, but not, they usually don't know how to write and read in Spanish. Not every parent who sends their children to the school is from Argentina, but the school still embodies a wider education that most Latin American families want to have. Many of my friends tell me why at Argentina school, and my answer is always I take her to the best school that is available to us in Southern California. It's also an opportunity for the students to socialize and experience something their friends at their regular school don't have. It's fun being at this school. It's it's like learning a new language is so cool. And also it feels like we're being in Argentina because it's Argentinian school. There's so much that we get out of this school that um, I am bilingual now. I can go to apply for colleges and I can say that I went to the school for 12 years. And that's a lot to put in. While some students graduate and go on to bigger and better things, others come back to help the next generation. Francesca Quiramonte is an alumni from Leala that now teaches at the school. I currently teach history to the high school students from eighth grade to senior year. I wanted to just give back and teach the kids because I understood where they were coming from. It's really hard to come on a Saturday and to still continue doing yeah. classwork and homework um, after your Monday through Friday. But there's one Saturday every year that makes it worth their while. The school organizes a day dedicated to those traditions and cultures learned in class called El Día de la Tradición where the students perform dances from different parts of Argentina. Like El Carnaval from Brazil and parts of Argentina. Or La Danza de los Viejos, the dance of the old men from Mexico. and even La Chacarera from Santiago del Estero in Argentina. I sing songs that represent some of their different traditions, like their version of the Tooth Fairy, El Raton Pérez. or a song dedicated to the man who run their candy kiosk. As you can see, Spanish is more than a language. It's a cultural anchor that ties the 21 countries that speak it. This school celebrates that unity by not only sharing different parts of the Argentinian culture, but incorporating the other Latin American traditions as well. Los Angeles itself is very diverse, and this community represents the beauty of that diversity.